there and welcome back so so far we have spoken about this common skills the ones that you will need for your everyday gameplay regardless of what equipment you use regardless of what weapons you use regardless of what armor you use we've talked about those skills if you haven't seen that video check out the link in the description below we also talked about the skills for the sniper rifle if you haven't seen that video check down at the link in the description below as well <laughs> Today, we're gonna talk about assault rifles. My favorite, I love the assault rifles. One thing to keep in mind, and we're gonna go ahead and get started, is that you're gonna see some, some assault rifles here. The majority of the assault rifles are located in this category here. As you can see, all of what you're seeing in front of your screen are assault rifles. Every single one of these and the skills that we're gonna talk about today will encompass all of these that you see in front of you. The amazing AR-15, the amazing M16, Bushmaster, QBC, you name it. All of these right here. These are assault rifles. But there are some assault rifles in this section as well. So it is imperative that you look at these. If you have one of the weapons here, this is an assault rifle. The HK-14 Winter Forest. The AK-15 is also an assault rifle. The Ruger, my absolute favorite. It's an assault rifle and the ewe x95 is also an assault rifle let's get right into it and as we get started i want you to know that these skills are so important don't just buy the skills that i'm going to talk about today remember i mentioned in the previous video if you haven't seen it click on the link in the description below and check it out all of these skills that you see in front of your common skills and these apply to all of your weapons so it is imperative imperative that you purchase those skills but we're gonna house all of the basics or the most impacting skills for the assault rifle here now this one is not specifically for assault rifles but it does increase your reload speed by 15 percent so you have to get that a lot of people die when reloading especially if you have a weapon like the m16 that is such a powerful weapon but it has such a low amount of ammo you die while reloading so that reload speed is very important this one here increases the effective range. So what happens is your weapon has a specific amount of range that it will reach. Some assault rifles are 55, some out there are 45, some are 57. What that means is that at that distance, it will keep that same dispersion that you have because it's just like any other weapon in real life, right? The farther you get back, even with assault rifles, right? The bullets won't go straight anymore. It has a specific amount of range. This one increases that range so that your bullets go straight even farther by 5%. So let's make it, let's make this easy math, right? What that means is if your range is 100, no weapon out there has 100 range, but I just want to make easy math, right? <laughs> so your range is 100, you can get 5% of that. So that means that it's going to go to 105, right? Now you've improved your range. Obviously, this is super important. It increases your health points. You have to get that. That's so important. Increases accuracy by 10%. This was not specifically for assault rifle, but you need to get this. What this is, is it stabilizes the weapon. It's not necessarily the dispersion. This is accuracy. So instead of your weapon having this crazy recoil all over the place and all that shaking, this improves that accuracy by 10%. This is imperative. Increases the number of clips by 100. So what that means is that you'll get one additional clip or some people call it a magazine. So important, right? Again, especially in a, such a powerful weapon like the M16 that doesn't have that many clips or magazines. This one will give you an additional one. It is imperative that you get that one. This one increases your damage by 5%. I don't even have to tell you. You already know you're going to need this one, right? <laughs> it increases your damage. This one's for, for knives although it's in the assault section, but if you're a knife user, you can go this route. This one increases your med kit use speed by 50%, so important. It's how quickly you inject yourself with those injections, right? Whether you're using the white one, the green one, the red one, or the yellow one, it's how quickly you inject and you can get back to aiming. So this one's important. This one, this one increases your zoom factor by 60%. I talked about it in the last video and I'll say it again, do not, do not, if you have not purchased all three stages, do not purchase all three stages. I say this because 60% zoom 
is huge now it is the only thing about this is that this is for a sniper rifles okay this is not for your assault rifle this is for a sniper rifle so if you're a sniper rifle user don't do it if you're a assault rifle user this won't affect you but if you're a sniper user don't do it don't do it that's way too much zoom this one decreases the damage by 20 percent of any shotgun out there it's not for assault rifle but it is important that you get that this one increases your armor points by 20 points we know we need armor right this one gives you three point generation with every two seconds so basically every two seconds your armor starts to increase so you've seen people that their armor increases throughout the game that's because they purchase all three stages of these this one increases your armor resistance by 100 percent but this one specifically only for the stormtrooper armor which is not that great i do not recommend that even for a low level player i wouldn't say that you should purchase this armor save your gold if you don't want to spend that much gold because you want a good weapon first then get the demo mon armor that one's not too expensive if you don't have enough for the kevlar or you don't have enough for the sniper armor but do not get this one <laughs> believe me it is not that strong and it won't last you very long and last but last but not least this one also is not specifically for assault rifles but it decreases incoming damage by 60 percent over five seconds one time per lifetime when your health drops your hp that means health points drops below 20 points what this means is that if your health drops below 20 points and it, it sounds like it won't happen but yes it does happen especially those that apply strategy like myself you often find yourself hiding and coming out and hiding and coming out and you get shot and then you hide back and you only have 20 points what this one this is now it decreases all incoming damage every weapon no matter what they use whether it was a mine whether it was a shotgun it doesn't matter what weapon it is it decreases the damage of that weapon by 60 percent in five seconds so that one's super imperative that you do get those and as we move to the other ones these ones are not for assault rifles don't be that person i'll say it again do not be that person that goes in here and buys all these skills just because you you want to unlock them these are for my this one's for a machine gun for example don't waste your gold you're an assault rifle user you, you don't need to improve machine guns right i have all of these because at some point i used to play with a machine gun but again do not buy the ones that say for machine guns you're a, you're an assault rifle user don't do that and in this category as well these are pertained specifically for other stuff as well but speed super important you're an assault rifle user you need to be able to shoot at a close range at a far range speed will help you out speed is life unlock both of these these will be a big benefit to you if you like this video if you like our channel give us a like subscribe hit the notification bell we have another video coming out on skills shortly help us out we'll see you in the next one